Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We're working more on my RPG Maker project. I made some progress today while I was out <coughs> with my support staff, excuse me. <coughs> oh, excuse me again, holy crap. I didn't get a lot done. As you can see, I did, I did the, um, grassy borders like I did down here. I made them one more tile bigger all around. I also made a church area over here and also a small, well, it's going to have a cemetery just like over here on, I don't know why it does that. I would count this as a bug. Something I didn't cover in my review. Because I forgot about that bug. Like I did down here, this church also has a cemetery as well. And I think this church is actually bigger than this one over here. But I'm busy. What are you doing, huh? What are you doing, little buddy? I'm busy. I'm working. I'm making, I'm trying to make some money here. No biting wires, okay, buddy? And you still have food in your bowl. I checked it earlier. I'll feed you later. So be a good boy, okay? Alright, kitty's off the desk for now. He wanted to say hi, I guess. I don't know. You might have heard a meow. And if you did, Leave a thumbs up. And if you didn't, I don't know. I, Because no one can see the thumbs down anymore unless you use an add on for internet browsers. So, I don't know. I guess if you didn't hear meow, I guess maybe comment down below that you didn't hear meow. I don't know. I can't really think of anything else. Um, let's see. So yeah, I'm... I don't really have room to expand it because of how many buildings there are. But it will st it'll still have more grave sites than the other one. Despite it having a smaller area. And I could expand it out over this way as well. Which I might do. I might do that. I don't know. Yeah, I might expand it out to like maybe here. Yeah, actually, you know what? I will. And then the top part can be... Yeah, that's actually a good idea. Expand it two more 17 by 17 squares for the grid. And then all that up there can be the cemetery. The front part can be the front area. Where you walk in at. And I can... Yeah, I'll do that. So hold on. And I don't know if I want to keep this or not. Actually, hold on. I want to check something real quick. Tile sets inside where is that one at hold on outside is it what's up buddy what are you doing if you're wanting food you still have food in your bowl go look okay buddy so it's a smaller ones okay and then blood so i might do that yeah i might keep that there or move it somewhere else i don't know yet um and before i get too involved in this for those that are watching, content will not slow down for this, but come Thursday, depending on the price of the bundle, and I, I know I have all of the, well, okay, the, no, hold on. This one does not exist. Ignore that one. I'm only using that one for reference points. Because I have a friend that I play with on Mondays. And I have a couple of um, decks that I want to buy in real life. 
One of them is going to cost me a hundred bucks, though, which is unfortunate. So ignore, ignore this. It does not exist. So I know I have all of these to play. I know, and I have been slacking on them, especially Everspace 2. I was waiting for an update on that. It's come out. I need to play it again. I know. Well, actually, just want to ignore it. I don't actually need that anymore. <laughs> ignore it. I know I have all these games to play. <laughs> I know. <clears throat> but there's another bundle coming out. And it's this. Depending on the price point, I'm going to buy it. And I'm going to play it Thursday. Videos for it may not come out right away for those interested. Just a heads up. I'm going to continue recording. I'm not going to promise this, but I'm going to continue recording one video, hopefully every day. I'm not going to promise that, though. It might be a 30 minute to an hour video or maybe an hour and a half video. It depends. It depends if my right arm, which is my mouse arm, will let me do it or not. Because I've explained before, I do have issues with that. And I. But if you're wanting food, you still have food in your bowl. Go look, okay? I know you need more, but there's still food there. Don't argue with me, buddy, okay? Hey, go look in your bowl. I looked earlier when I came home, and you still have some food, okay? You're fine. But depending on the price point, will be if I buy it right away or not. It hopefully won't be any more than 60 bucks, but no one Square Enix in their current blunders, you never know. So expect that coming Thursday. If not, I'll let you know. But let's jump back into this. And if you are a fan of Kingdom Hearts, I have technically never played Kingdom Hearts 1 as well. I've only played like maybe four hours of it. I've only gotten to... Is it ta the Tarzan world? Is that... One of the areas, yeah, it was Tarzan. And I had no idea where to go. Plus, it wasn't my game. It was at a friend's when I was, like, like really young. So I didn't really have time to play it. So, and I, I've... I've, yeah. Even though I do own it on PS4, I never played it on PS4. I only played Chain of Memories, which is what I'm going to start with. Because reasons, I think Chain of Memories is honestly better than Kingdom Hearts 1. I'm sorry if I pissed you off on that one, but that's my opinion. And, and Kingdom Hearts 2 is obviously better than Kingdom Hearts 1. So, yeah. I'm going to start with Chain of Memories, then play Kingdom Hearts 1, then 2. But yeah, that's just my opinion on it. If you don't agree with that choice, I don't care. I I honestly prefer Chain of Memories over, honestly, even, I prefer it even over number two. So, because the whole deck building thing and whatnot, I actually enjoy it. Like, it, it's fun. And it's not a roguelike, which is fine. I mean, I guess it kind of is, actually. Yeah, no, it is. Yeah, I know. It was my was it my first roguelike game ever? Yeah, it was, actually. Be yeah, it was, actually. So I guess I do play those. Interesting. <laughs> I didn't know that until it is now. Cool. Yeah, it actually makes sense. Yeah, actually it does make sense. It is a roguelike because you choose the maps you want with the cards. And then that's with the room you get. And then how many doors they'll have. Yeah, it is a roguelike. I did not know that until just now. Damn. It's a roguelike deck builder. Huh. 
I learn something new every day. And I utterly despise roguelikes and deck builders. Well, I used to like Yu-Gi-Oh, but Yu-Gi-Oh is just... We're not going to go there. <laughs> it's not the same as it used to be when it first came out. Let's just say that. Bud, what are you doing? I know you ha I know you want food, but there's still food in your bowl. Go look, okay? Go look. Don't argue, buddy. You have food in your bowl. I always check your bowl. I know you're a kitty cat and it's hard to understand. Don't talk hey Don't talk back, bud, okay? You're being a good boy. If you want treats Thursday, be a good boy, okay? Okay. <laughs> I think you said I'm sorry. Are you wanting pets or food? Do you want pets? Or do you want food? Do you want treats? No response from either. Okay. Don't worry. I if you think I'm abusing my cat, I'm not. I always check his bowl for food and water. He still has food and water in both of his bowls. So before you report me to whomever, I'm not abusing my cat. I know better. <laughs> I'm not a dick. <laughs> I know better. I love cats. I prefer cats over dogs. If I was going to abuse a cat, I wouldn't get a cat. In ever. Like, whatsoever. Like, yeah, I would just never get a cat. Because there's no point then. Because if you're a cat owner, then you know how cats are. They look at their bowl and they see that there's not enough food in there f to their satisfaction. And they're like, I need more food. But there's still food in the bowl for them to eat. And they constantly beg for more. It can be annoying, I know. But they constantly beg for more until they are fed. I'm trying to teach my boy that there's still food there deal with what you have now and I will feed you once you eat all of your food it's a hard process yes and he may never get trained to do so and that's okay but he has to learn you don't always get what you want even though you're a cute animal so don't worry I'm not abusing my cat because if I was abusing him, I would be in jail right now. And if I was, my family comes over every day. They would tell me, hey, you need to feed him. And I would. And my support staff also monitors that too. Because I have support staff three times a week. And they also, when they walk by, they take a peek. Bud, you have food, okay? You have food in your bowl? Hey, careful. Uh -uh. I know I know how tech-savvy cats are, okay? I've had a cat open up my computer's registry before. I've even had a cat open up Prune Hub. And that one was hilarious. Opened up the internet, and it typed in a site. Bud, you have food. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I know you're saying no. I can hear it in your voice. I can hear it in your voice. Bud, do you want trees on Thursday, yes or no? <laughs> it was 
Was that a no for treats on Thursday? Are you serious, Kitty? Come on. They're for your teeth. Do you not like your catnip treats? He's thinking about it. I <laughs> got him on that one. <laughs> I got you on that one, little boy. <laughs> And I'm sure you guys are yelling to feed the damn cat. I will later. But I'm busy with this. I'm busy entertaining you guys right now. I will feed him after I'm done recording. Don't worry. He can wait. He still has food. And I'm going to get food for myself after this as well. Because I'm hungry as well. And there's been times where I fed him and he didn't eat a single bite. He just wants more food in his bowl for his satisfaction so that he knows there's food in his bowl. I know how he operates. He's a cat. He's my little boy. I know how he operates. I've had him for several months now. I know how he... I know... All of his mannerisms. He's probably in my bedroom pouting. Going to sleep. Because he's quiet now. <laughs> but he'll get fed in a bit. He doesn't have to worry. I, was, I just wanted to record a quick video with some updates on this and you know force myself to work on it as well well I say force myself <clears throat> I probably shouldn't say that anymore <laughs> it sounds like I hate doing it whenever I don't I enjoy doing this and I enjoy recording it for you guys as well as long as you guys enjoy the content Do I want to add tall grass or no? Or do I just want to have... I might keep it clean cut because... Yeah. Because it is a... Yeah, I know. I'll have it clean cut. The flowers, however, I'll have down. Because it makes sense. It is a church and... Graveyard as well. Actually, you know what? I'll have the graveyard down here as well. <coughs> and I'll still extend it. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll have... <coughs> Damn. Smart for took the elevator. Good God, dude. So I'll have all of what I'm doing now be a graveyard for people who have died. And I'll also extend it out as well. For more. Because this is the main capital. The main capital. Is it? I forgot. No, it's the first major city. It's not the main capital. If I... Or is... Do I want it to be the main capital? No. It's just the first main city. If I ever do make a main capital, it will more than likely be multiple maps yeah it'll be multiple maps I'll have I'll make it yeah okay if I do decide to make a let's say like a map that's Okay, so take New York. Obviously, I'm not going to be able to make a map that big. Because that would take up everything I have resource-wise for maps. But take New York. Pretty big city, obviously. But let's say I make a map that big. Or I want to make a city that grand. I would make it 
want with okay so I want to use this as an example this would be the main hub for the city all the businesses and stuff would be in the middle well actually how would I lay that out hmm I don't know actually how I would lay that out I would have a, a part in the middle a part on top a part on each side and a part on the bottom and that would be the major city and it would be each map would be the same size as this one because I can now because they finally added what I've always wanted in this pro in this program it's not the way I want it but they finally added it which is nice Maybe they'll fix it to the, to the way I want it to be in a future update, hopefully. If not, I'll deal with it. I don't care. But yeah, that's probably what I would do for a major city. This is just the first city. And that would be a grand project. It, yeah, it would be basically like one of these maps right here one of them would be nothing but housing one of them would be like a massive church like with the biggest graveyard ever because that city is so massive it needs basically an entire map for a graveyard it would be that big because there's that many people living in that city one part would be for the royal side like the upper the highest part of the city would be basically what I'm working on now but it would be nothing but that entire map would be nobles and maybe if I'm able to a castle I can make a castle as well to go with it if I can if I could figure out how to do that and I, and I might do that too I might do that I don't know it's just an idea I'm not going to add it to the idea list because the idea list is for actually for the actual backbone side of the game and not the drawing side of the game. And if I if I did do that, it would take <coughs> let's see, this one took a month and a half roughly. This one's been two weeks, three weeks top so far. I could be off on the time frame for this one. And I'm almost done with this one in less than a month, I think. Actually, how long have I been working on this one? I don't know. Yeah, that that project would be massive. Especially doing all the interiors. But luckily, I found a way, a way to do the interiors better. Just one big map and just combine them all into one big map. Versus, you know, because it makes more sense that way. And it saves you on maps, too. So. But that's just an idea. I may not do it. If I do it, however, it will be fun. Trust me. I will love doing it. And I still... But who knows? I'm again. I may not do it. Um. 
I want to zoom out some more here so I can get <sighs> okay hmm can't really see when I, I can see but you guys probably can't in case you're on a small monitor or like a laptop watching or your phones and if you are watching on your phone I would suggest waiting till you get home on or in a library somewhere to use a proper screen just my suggestion you don't have to but it's my suggestion because I do a lot of zooming out and if you're on a phone it's hard to see I know I've been there and phones tend to do automatic quality especially if you're using your internet your, your phone's data and if you are using your phone's data and you did not know about the automatic quality you can hit the um settings icon or the nut icon or whatever you want to call it and you can change it yourself to where you want to use more data and have the best quality possible which is like 720p or whatever it is for phones but I would suggest wait until you get home on a proper computer before you watch because of the in and out for the map stuff and the blurriness because you know phones <coughs> what else do I want to add to <coughs> for decor wise hmm I could add some grass actually you know what I wonder this use Uncle Phil. Okay, that's what I thought it would do. We may not use Uncle Phil. Actually, you know what? I could use Uncle Phil. Hold on. I'm curious. What does Uncle Phil do when it comes to this? I mean, we have our graveyard. <laughs> we have our graveyard. We're done. I'm done, boys and girls. We have a graveyard. <laughs> That's lazy, though. Sorry, Uncle Phil. We're not going to use you today. <laughs> That's just lazy. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hey, Uncle Phil. <laughs> Actually, you know, hmm. What does it look like if I... I'm curious, hold on. Eh, now nah, I'm good. I'm good. It covers up the awesome road. I'll pass. Yes, we're not going to use Uncle Phil. And if you're asking me why I call it Uncle Phil, I don't know. I honestly don't know. But I, I, I do kind of want some. Actually, moss. Ooh. Oh, come on. It doesn't. Uh. Screw you. Actually, I wonder. Hold on. Fuck. Maybe this one? Oh. And then. Uh, it's behind it, though. It doesn't really. I don't have to put. Action, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, if I do this, and then I do that, and then I take this, and then I take, no, and then I do this, and then I, it doesn't work, it doesn't work, gross, it, it doesn't look right, ugh. 
<coughs> it doesn't look right so that is basically useless and it's called moss but it 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 doesn't look right at all I guess it can be a path yeah I can so okay so this is not moss or is it hold on no that's not moss at all I'm sorry that's a freaking path this is a th okay I've said it before but whoever the fuck translated this shit fired their asses that is a freaking golf course sand pit look what they translated it as in the bottom left corner under a map tree how is that a ledge when it is obviously a golf course sand pit whoever the fuck translated this shit fire their asses I'm being serious. That is not a ledge. That is a golf course sand pit. Oh my god. Does that mean I can make a golf course? Wait a minute. Can I make golf courses? I don't have a golf ball. Damn. Wait a minute, hold on. There's the hole. There's the hole. We have a sand pit. We have a water hazard. Oh, that's the wrong one, hold on. We have a water hazard. <laughs> we have a golf course. We can make a golf course. We just don't have golf clubs or golf balls. But tell me that's not a sand trap for a golf course. How is that a ledge? I'm sorry. Whoever mm, fired their asses. They're freaking idiots. They're fucking idiots, dude. How is this a ledge? When it is obviously fucking sand. Yeah. That is obviously sand. We have a golf course right here. There's the hole. Or. There's the hole. Actually, hold on. What do I have for the hole? <laughs> There's the hole. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's the hole right there. We can make a golf course. Oh, shit. Do I want to do that or not? Should I make a golf course? Ho <laughs> Here's a club. <laughs> We've seen a golf ball. Found it. Oh wait. Damn. Where's me a golf ball? I need a golf ball. I need a golf ball. Come on now. I need, I, I need, I need a golf ball. I want, I want to add a golf club, a golf course. I need a golf ball. Come on. Damn it. I mean, if I could make that right down there, not part of this, we would have our golf ball. And then this would be the golf club. Our dream is ruined. Damn it. 
And we can have hazards too. Oh. Oh. Damn, our dream is ruined. Actually, hold on. Mmm, I wonder. Are there any round ball like objects? No. I kind of want to make a golf course now, but there's no. Oh. I don't need this one. But hold on, let's browse the sci fi stuff. We might find a golf ball. <laughs> we might find our golf ball. Hold on now. I kind of want to make a golf course. It'll be fun to do. Damn it. Is that Mother Brain from Metroid? What the frick? Better not use that or Nintendo will shoot me. I don't see a golf ball. Damn. Man, what is that thing? Hold on. What is that thing? Huh. Hold on. I'm gonna look. I'm curious. I'm a curious George. What is that thing? That's a fan. That's a vent. Okay. That's not a golf ball. Dang it. I want a golf ball. I want, I want to make a golf club. I'm gonna make a golf course. It'd be fun to have one. Because even, even back in medieval times, surely they had golf courses. Wait a minute. Is that, a, is that, a, is that what I think it is? No, it's not. Okay. Damn, there's just nothing good to use for. What is this? Robot arm. Ah. Okay, hold on. What about the other one? I'm curious. Um. Outside. Out. What the fuck, dude? Ah, hey. What about what about this stuff? Yeah. Hold on now. What about this stuff? Is there a golf ball here? Is that what I think it is? No, it's a helmet. I mean, that could count as a golf ball. It's round. That's a conveyor belt. Oh, junk stall. Okay. Car. <laughs> That's a chimney. How I might use that instead of the ones I'm using now. Man, there's no golf balls. Are you serious? But we have golf balls in the future. And there's no golf balls? What the frick, dude? <gasps> hamburger. Holy shit, dude. Is that fries? No. <laughs> Ask Soda Pop. Nice, dude. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess my dream of making a golf course is shattered. Damn. Oh well, it happens. Not a big deal, I guess. Not a big deal. 
bummer. Oh well. I mean, we can still make one using what we have, but it wouldn't be the same. I want a golf ball and, and um, uh, a caddy bag, but we don't have that, and it sucks. Oh well. <coughs> I mean, I I don't have wells down yet. I need to put some wells down. Yeah. Oh well. It is what it is. Our dreams of a golf course are gone, and that's okay. I don't mind. Maybe in a future game. Who knows? Ugh. All right. Actually, no, you know what? I actually won't put tall grass down. I'm just going to put, um... Some gray stones down. Oh. Yeah, okay, yeah. I'll put these ones down. And actually, I might... I'm going to still extend it, yeah. Yeah, I'll still make it bigger. Put one in a corner, put like one more over here, and then let's change it up some here. So these are monuments, but they can also be gravestones, because they look like gravestones. Place them where it makes sense to have them. That's the whole meal ticket for this part of the process. I also put some down here. Alright, so now I need... Is there any other ones? No. Actually, yeah, there is. Monument C. Okay, so these are the actual gravestones. Yeah, these are... Yeah, these are gravestones, yeah. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Is that Japanese? No, there's no way it's no. It's not. There's no way they would do that. There's no way they would put Japanese on those. If they did, that's pretty cool. It's like a little Easter egg, maybe. Who knows? I don't know. Alright, put some more down. And these are the ones that the people who are poor can afford. And there's more of them because, well, I mean, look where they live. <laughs> and the people who are, you know, more uppity, they have better means of survival so there's not as many of those ones And they won't cross. Actually, I want to move this one up to there. Yeah. And then I want to do this too. I don't want them crossing the borders. So this line here is the border. And like I said, there's more of the smaller ones. Because the smaller ones are for the low income people or the homeless because they don't have means of getting care they they can afford it if, if they work <coughs> but it's still hard for them to get the care they need 
because of, well, not only that, but there's other reasons behind it too. And I think I mentioned that, oh, did I? Yeah, um, every interior building has four things inside of them. And I'm sure you can spot it real easy. Between these two right here, they have four important details. And every building has them for the interior. And those four important details symbolize something. I'm not going to say what, if, and if I have said already, that's, then I have. But I don't remember if I did or not. But if I have, again, whatever. But those four important things, that, if you spot them, don't say anything. If you spot them, leave a thumbs up. If you don't spot them, don't say anything. Just keep looking. You'll spot them eventually. They're not that hard to find. But those four items, again, they mean something very important. They are a important role in the story. I'm just not quite sure how I want the, the story to play out. But they do hold an important role in the story. I will say that much. Alright, and I think that is done. I'm going to extend this out some more. But I think I'm going to go ahead and cut the video here. I know I didn't get much done. And I do apologize on that. But I'm hungry. My cat's hungry. And I need to feed him before he starts to bite wires. Because he has before. But anyways, I will see you guys next time. Hopefully tomorrow. And if maybe later on tonight, who knows, we'll see. But have a wonderful day. And I will see you guys next time.